Welcome back everyone. Hope everyone is doing well today. Uh, today we're gonna make a grilled cheese sandwich. Simple, easy, quick, probably less than five minutes. The only time it's gonna take is for us to warm up the pan and we're gonna get over there in a, in a short while. So the three things that we need to make a grilled cheese sandwich is butter, bread, two slices of bread, and a slice of cheese. Or if you want a double grilled cheese, you can do double the cheese, okay? But the most important thing is to butter your bread so that it's nice and buttery, okay? So we're gonna go ahead and do that first. We're gonna butter the bread. Now we're gonna butter the bread only on the sides that we're gonna grill it on, okay? Because the inside is what we're gonna use for the cheese. So we're just sp spreading the butter onto your bread so that when we go ahead and put it into the pan, it'll be ready to go. <clears throat> now, the other thing I wanna show you is that I've turned the pan on, come with me. I've turned it on because it's gonna take a very short amount of time for it to warm up, but I'm gonna up the volume to get it hot, okay? Let's go back over here to our sandwich. Um, oh, by the way, that's a, a grilled cheese frying pan, but you guys can use any ordinary pan that you wanna use. Okay, that one just makes it a little bit easier. Um, we're gonna go ahead and put our cheese on the side that's not buttered, okay? And then we're gonna put the other side on top of the cheese that's buttered. So both sides, the bottom and the top are buttered. Okay, we're gonna take it over here to our pan. We're gonna put it into the pan and we're gonna get a spatula. Let me just wash my hands because I have a little bit of butter on there. Um, we're gonna get a spatula so that we can crush it down a little bit. But in the meantime, it's getting nice and um, getting nice and uh, warm. So here's our spatula. Do you hear it sizzling? All right, we wanna just go ahead and um, I'm gonna get a knife because my butter is going to stick to the, to the spatula. All right, I'm just, I just wanna press it down so that it starts to penetrate the butter, or the bread, I should say, I'm sorry. You hear it sizzling, okay? So what we're trying to do is get it nice and brown on one side, and then we're gonna flip it over to do the other side shortly. Yeah, I think it's starting to stick, the cheese on the inside, but I wanna give it a little bit more time just so that and the only reason I'm using a knife is because the butter is sticky. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna flip the sandwich over. You have to push your, oh, look at that. Oh my goodness, talk about golden. Now, you don't need the knife anymore because the knife, the butter's already ni nice and penetrated into the, the sandwich. But this is really beautiful. And when we're finished, we're gonna cut it just so you can see the oozing cheese. I know this seems really simple, you guys, but on a day when you don't wanna to cook too heavy, this is a perfect sandwich for people to eat. You can even fill it with tomatoes or ham or turkey. I'm gonna flip it another time, just so that it keeps golden or it keeps getting golden for me. This is like the perfect little pan, but I can, again, if you don't have one of these square pans, go ahead and use a regular frying pan, okay? I think this is perfect. All right, I'm turning off my stove top. I'm gonna keep, I'm just gonna leave it a little longer. I'm gonna get a plate. Actually, I wanna get a cutting board because I'm gonna cut that, I'm gonna cut it so that you guys can see the, so we're gonna take it out of our pan, put it onto our cutting board, and then we're gonna cut them in half, just like this. Okay, let's see. Oop, can't see the cheese, but that's okay because you know that it's in there. We place it in there. So, and we'll put it on our plate. Uh, let's get our spatula to do that so that we don't burn our hands. And there we have our grilled cheese sandwich. All right, you guys. We're done for the day. Hope you enjoy it. It's a really simple recipe. Tomorrow we'll do something a little bit more harder. Have a great afternoon. Bye.